Happy Friday, Bobcat Nation. John Burdett, the very proud principal of Salina High School. What a week we had. Um, it was such a, a good time this whole week having the kids here and just getting into school and getting used to things. And so um, we had such a, a wonderful time at our pep rally today. Um, uh, before we get to that, I want to talk about next week. Next week we're getting into our regular schedule. So on Monday and Wednesdays we have our regular bell schedule and I sent that to, uh, in a previous newsletter. It's also linked below so you can click on the regular bell schedule. It's really not that much different. Each class on a regular day is, is three minutes longer. On a uh, cat's day, which is Tuesday, Thursday, Friday, it's three minutes shorter so that we add that time for cat's time. So um, Monday. It's very important. We've got to be on time, and on time means early. So car riders, uh, please make sure that you get here a little bit earlier. Uh, we have about uh, five or ten kids that roll in after 8.30, so please get here because tardies start on Monday. We've given a week and a half of grace, and so now we need to get there. In between the periods, there's plenty of time for kids to get to class. Um, I was just out in the hall and, and just watching everything, and it, it's almost completely clear with about 30 to 45 seconds left. So there's plenty of time in between the periods uh, for our kids to get to and from class. So just make sure that we get here, them here on time. If a bus is late, don't worry, we won't count them tardy. Um, if a student is tardy, I've asked the teachers, I actually instructed the teachers, close and lock the door. The kids are gonna have to go down to the front office, get a tardy sheet. Uh, their first tardy is free. After that, their second uh, tardy starts adding detentions and things like that. There's a little sheet that they'll get and on the bottom of the sheet it lets them know they've got 48 hours to serve their detention or else that bumps up to a two hour Thursday, uh, Tuesday, Thursday school. And if they miss that, then it becomes a Saturday school. And we don't want that to happen. So make sure, just talk to your kids about being early to class. So there's plenty of time. Um, if something happens, we'll work with you as much as we can. Uh, like a train, every now and then that train comes through Salina, so we understand that, or uh, bad weather, things like that. But just run of the mill, just make sure that they're here on time, okay? Um, speaking of tardies, uh, going with attendance, our attendance so far this year has been incredible, 97.43%. That is outstanding. And that goes to um, our house points. So every nine weeks, every semester, the house, the house with the highest um, attendance rate, they get 100,000 points for their house. And then it, it drops from there. Second place is 50,000 points, so on and so forth. So make sure your kids get here. We want them here. Uh, if they're here, they can learn. And then we can take care of them and we can grow relationships through their houses. So um, speaking of houses, you might see this thing right here. These are uh, our kids said they didn't want uh, t-shirts for their houses. They wanted these lanyards. So these are the colors of the houses that every kid in each house, they got a lanyard that, that's respected to their house. So uh, ask your uh, student about that, see if they have theirs. If not, they can get with their house leader and get it. So uh, today we had an awesome pep rally. Uh, we, we brought the juice. And so uh, you're probably watching some film right now of it. We, each house uh, sent students down and we had a competition of squeezing oranges into a little container and then the winner of that got uh, 10,000 points the house and then we put it in a little jar and had someone try to drink it as fast as they could out of a uh, coffee straw and so uh, the winner of that got 10,000 points and then the overall winner got an additional 10,000 points and their house got the spirit stick so uh, congratulations to the pack they won the whole pep rally they took first place in both competitions and then overall so congratulations to miss reeves and the pack on winning all of that so uh but we had a great time the kids dressed up today in their house colors uh, we had such a great time and that's what we want we want our kids to have a great time get to uh have connections with each other and relationships they sat in their houses together so it was just all in it was a very good competition a lot of fun and, and uh healthy competition so all right, well, that's it for me. Everyone have a great weekend, and go Bobcats.